eating next time. That way, Hola, it's Jaffo Jumbo Salu. Hello, my loves, and today I'm with my friend Mel. Hi. And we're in Vegas, and we figured we need to talk about essentials you need to bring to Vegas. Yes, the weather is totally different here, so you need to be fully prepared to stay fresh the whole time. Yeah, especially when you're going to pool parties and it's like 102 degrees, you're just not gonna be able to look the same as you do anywhere <laughs> else. So there's some things you have to do before you go out to these pool parties, go out at night, and some things you can bring on your trip that will make all the difference when it comes to beauty essentials and fashion essentials. Yes. So what are like top three style essentials? For styling, I think it's definitely necessary to have like a small, cute bag. Yeah. Definitely want to keep your belongings in a tiny little bag. This is a fanny pack, but you could also wear so it as a crossbody. I body. love that. But like the fanny packs are very in right now. Yeah, and mine is literally just a crossbody, and I really don't mind if it gets too wet or ruined because I feel like in Vegas there's a high chance that your stuff is gonna get messed up. Definitely. Just with all the drinking and partying and crazy people, water and everything. I mean, it's just a lot. And I recommend bringing a different night bag that's perfect, but definitely small. Small. Because the clubs are pretty strict. They check almost everything. everything. Like, you cannot bring anything into a club, pretty much. And I heard you can't bring compacts, you were saying. Is that yes. still true? Yes, so to the pool, they're very strict. And you can't bring, like, packs of gum or, like, mint boxes or anything. So yeah. when you do have your bag, I would just keep it just to your bare essentials, your ID, credit cards, cash. Yeah, some cash um, And that's about it. I really yeah. wouldn't go too intense with your day pool party um, bag packing because they might take it away from you. Yeah, so definitely keep that in mind when it comes to going out to day parties or pool parties and nightclubs in Vegas. I don't know if I'm going to make this a separate video, but we'll definitely do a what to pack. Just yeah. like your few essentials so you don't get overwhelmed. So you just put your outfits together right. and it'll make it work. There's a couple of things you can repeat, like cover-ups. All you really need is three to four days worth of outfits. And if you know exactly what to pack, your suitcase is lighter, your trip is easier, Stress and you're not free. frantically trying to figure out what what to bring for Vegas. Perfect. So. Okay, so number two, for me, I would say sunglasses, right? The bigger, the better. Yes, because you don't realize the sun here is on another level. It's very strong. When I walk outside, I if I don't have glasses, I'm literally <laughs> squinting, and if I forgot them, I'd probably be miserable my whole trip. Definitely. So you need some real sunglasses that are going to block your eyes from the sun, but still look super cute. Definitely. So I recommend like bringing two, or if you can't find two to three that you love just have one pair that you can wear with everything and that you don't mind losing just in case things get a little crazy that's true you do not want to lose your nice sunglasses because again it's vegas so anything, anything can, can happen, happen. <laughs> especially if your makeup doesn't hold up in the heat we put the big shades on and yes. you're gonna be fine and you're good to go and with that i do want to add you always need to have waterproof mascara always like no other if whether you any get place splashed you it, yeah. even if you don't plan on going in the pools know, which most so people sweaty. don't go in the pools don't don't. It's so dirty. It's not oh my safe. God. At least at the pool parties. If you're, yeah, at, a if resort, you're at a resort, that's different. that's different. But yeah, the day pool parties, you're probably not going to be submerged in the pool, but it's still really important to have waterproof mascara yeah. so that you don't have any like runny accidents. There's lots of misters. Everywhere you go, there's misters. Like the theme parks type misters. I, it is, and they're intense. If you go to get a drink, you're going to get misted. If you're walking through a hotel waiting in line, you're going to get misted. There's misters everywhere, so yeah. Waterproof mascara. Mascara and a setting spray is huge. Essential. It's we both have the same one. We use the Urban Decay All Nighter. All nighter and all day. -er. Spray that <laughs> as much as you can because you're gonna need it when you're in the heat and sweating, and it really makes your makeup last all For day. All night. Yeah. And, and all, all day. Night. <laughs> so yeah, I think those are definitely go-tos. I agree. All right, guys. Well, we're going to go to the pool party now, and I will check back with you later. Thank you, Mel. You're welcome. For helping me in this video, and I'll see you guys later. Bye. Bye.